Oh, Elfric, do my prayers reach thine ears? Oh. Good day, Commander. Oh. Oh. Cheers, Koi Fish. Welcome back to the stream, dude. How you doing, man? Man, my stream deck's been lagging. Marceline means defender of the sea in French. That's pretty badass. <laughs> The piece that I currently have is called the Zob, Z-O-B. So I named it Zob Marley. And that's also the one I got free from a, a contest on Weed Maps. The base broke. Like, it didn't like shatter, but it broke in two pieces. My brother was able to glue it back together. It lives. It saves a lot of weed and gets me pretty damn high. So I knew I had to buy a volcano vape after using my X's. Gotcha. Yeah, I'll send a pic. Nice, thanks playing some destiny for sure man how are you liking the expansion sam um they um uh, sam they said to be respectful in the church just cutting wind as you uh as you go in i'm hearing their stories before i steal from them that's pretty respectful <laughs> woman age 31 a mother who brought her son to the cathedral she spends much of her time praying that her son will find his way in this cruel world. What she doesn't realize is that her son worries just as much about her as she does about him. Information gleaned. A hidden item. Thanks for the herbs. Appreciate it. I could provoke Ooh. her, but eh, it's okay. I don't think I'll really get much out of it. This room is reserved for use by specific members of the Order of the Sacred Flame. Yeah, I heard the story in the in this new DLC is pretty pretty meh. But I heard there's some nice additions to the gameplay that make it pretty fun. So yeah, I hope you're enjoying it. Cleric age 38. A cleric working at the cathedral. She is deathly afraid of most everything, but particularly hates how the old cathedral looks at night. She prays daily that she won't be put on the night watch. Pilgrim's robe. Appreciate it. Dark amulet. Reduces dark damage. Nice, nice. Ooh. There we go. Paying my respects to the actor who played Commander uh, Zavala. Oh, yeah, man. He, he passed away the other day. Yeah. Age 60. Heard about that. Yeah, definitely RIP. I remember seeing one of the popular posts on Reddit. Um, I believe it was in the Destiny subreddit. Um, it said, uh, Bungie should make it so that um, Guardians can have... Like the armor that he wore has like uh, I don't know if there's like layered army layered armor where uh, you have this you have the stats of what you're currently wearing kind of like a transmog so that everyone can uh, like pay respects by, by looking like the commander for their guardian I think that'd be I think that'd be pretty cool yeah man he's only 60 I never watched the show but I know it's really good from everyone that I talked to but uh, I know he was also in the wire and also he played, um, um, he voiced the character in Horizon Zero Dawn, I think. Cleric, age 32. A cleric working at the cathedral. Though hired to be a cook, he loves nothing more than a good secret and longs to hear the confessions of the townsfolk. He is also quite chatty, so one must be careful what is said in his presence. Ah. Inspiriting Plum, thank you. Olive of Life, 80%. Easy. Magic Melody raises the elemental attack of the target for 2 to 4 turns. I like the name! <laughs> Thanks, Smokey. <laughs> really I rarely hit out of it nowadays, but... Yep, that's, that's my baby right there. 
Bongs are definitely my preferred way to, uh, to smoke. Are the bags on volcanoes still, like, really huge? I've been attending service at the cathedral since the pontiff before last. Good for you. Townsperson, age 44, a most devout adherent to the Order of the Sacred Flame. She has been visiting the cathedral for decades and knows more of its inner workings than any cleric. The depth of her knowledge even extends to those who work there. Not even the most long-serving cleric dares defy her, lest they be reminded of the foibles of their early days. Bottle of Blinding Dust. Appreciate it. <laughs> resistant nuts? My nuts are always resistant. Wait, what? What does that mean? Merely living gives folks plenty to be panicking over. Hunter, age 39. A hunter who has made a home for himself in the nearby mountains. He frequently comes to the cathedral to confess for taking the lives of living creatures and give thanks for the blessings of the natural world. Oh, what a nice guy. Whenever he lands something particularly large, he gives the finest cuts of his hunt to the church's thanks. Hmm, the very noble. Very noble move. Composite bow. Hells yeah. Beast liver. Restores BP to a single ally and raises their accuracy and critical rate for five turns. Oh, dude, that's awesome. Thanks. Poison arrow. March of Accuracy. Raise the accuracy of the target for two to five turns. Not bad, not bad. Who am I currently guiding right now? Raise the elemental defense of the target. Yeah, it's kind of meh. 80%? That's a pretty good chance. Pretty good chance. Lance Reddick didn't didn't know he passed. Yeah, foot long. He's been all over Reddit. He was in the Wire subreddit. He was in the Destiny subreddit. He was in the gaming subreddit. Yeah. Even though I haven't seen or heard much of his work, I did play a little bit of Destiny, so I know who he he played. Um, but yeah, in, in any case, uh, yeah. Wishing him uh, and his family, uh, you know. All the best during this time. A long-serving cleric who spent several years as attendant to Pontiff Yorg. Though he has no particularly noble talents, Yorg prized his honest and reliable nature. He now strives to keep the order running in the late Pontiff's stead. Information gleaned. Guide with ease. Oh, nice. Light wand. Sweet. Sacred Flame Serenade. Grant the target the ability to reflect one elemental attack. Ooh. 54% chance, though, to guide. A little iffy. Res the residents of this town will be more respective to your guidance. Ooh, let me see how much it is now. Oh, I think it's maybe for Temenos. Because that percentage chance didn't change at all. You still smoke, Sam? Rarely. Last time I smoked was uh, New Year's Eve. With uh, one of my high school friends. But yeah. Um, I've, I've cut down significantly. I still enjoy weed every now and then. But um, yeah, I was using it as a crutch. For all of my problems and anytime I felt shitty, which was, which is not recommended and not a good idea. Uh, work sucked. <laughs> ah, fuck traffic. <laughs> ah, the increase in the, the price of my sandwich. <laughs> it's like, uh, might want to take it easy there, Sam. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, jokes aside. And it's also helped me save money because I'm not, because, uh, 
I was I was smoking less and I was vaping more like through a pen and man the convenience of pens just like when I was uh, vaping tobacco it became a pretty expensive habit <sighs> so yeah I still enjoy it but yeah I definitely treat it as more of a thing that I'll do with friends here and there as opposed to a daily thing and yeah no judgment to anybody that does use it on the daily you know, like you do you but I was just I I knew deep down that I was abusing it and I was using it as a crutch to run away from shit so yeah hold on let me I don't think I've heard this dialogue before oh shit this is a side story oops hold on I didn't mean to breeze through that dialogue I was hoping I could hear it again If we had one large soul stone of each type, fire, ice, thunder, and wind, the window could be restored, but alas. Oh! What? Large, though? I do have soul stones, but I don't... Yeah, I, I don't have any large ones yet. Okay. Good day. Hello there. Now she is going to get night shift and she will not have her dark amulet that will protect her from the ghosts. <laughs> Sam, how many hours you got in this game so far? Joe, I have... Let me... Hold on, I gotta catch up a chat. Hold up. Uh, we've made no progress whatsoever on repairing the cathedral window. His holiness will be heartbroken if he knew our cathedral was still bereft of its most beloved feature. The problem is, we lack the materials to effect repairs. If we had one large soul stone of each type, fire, ice, thunder, and wind, the window could be restored, but alas. Should you come into possession of four kinds of soul stone, the cathedral will be most grateful to receive them as a donation. Cleric, age 35. A cleric who handles church repairs and maintenance as a student of art, he has studied the cathedral's stained glass window as an artwork in itself. He can get carried away with academic theorizing, but his purity of heart won over even Pontiff Yorg. Plus 62 elemental attack from the Rod of Wisdom? Sheesh! Thank you. I believe that's everybody in this cathedral. Let me just switch over to nighttime real quick. Oh, there's the hidden item. Buckler. Nice. Nice little buckler. Sacrificial lights. Summonable eights. Let me see. Who? Uh... This is who we currently have. Five star strength, improved offense. Okay, no, he's still he's still better. Yeah, she's only three star strength. <laughs> I love how Ochet has that Naruto run. any superior jerky so I can't recruit her okay all right I believe we are finally done in this town chat I believe we have mugged and stole everything that we could <laughs>
I washed it and cleaned it. Okay, that's good. So it just has to grow more so I can pull off the broken nail. <gasps> Glad it's okay, though. Oh, hey, thanks for the gift sub. Yeah, Parpar, no problem, man. Thanks for being there when I gifted it to you. All good, man, no problem. Love you, Parpar. I love the seamless transitions with the music. It's so good. Okay, Samuel. All good, far, far. No problem, man. I know it's pretty late there for you. All good, man. All good. Been with me since fucking 2015, my dude. Assassin's Creed Unity. This is just the librarian, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, nice. Candy. Give me that Twizzler. Mountain sausage. <laughs> Lol. Shadow soul stone. Thanks. You don't, you don't mind, right? Cool. Thank you. Thank you for your contribution. It's for the greater good, Jack. It's for the greater good. Alright, let's scoot add on over. Actually, wait, wait, hold on. Let me talk to this guy real quick. And by that, I mean, let me see if I can steal shit. I almost missed you there, bro. Scholar H31, a scholar studying the relationship between geological features and ruins. He presented a thesis that the Isle of Illusions mentioned in the Order's legends actually exists, only to be laughed at and shunned by the academic community at large. Oh no, Sedge. That has not deterred him, however. His research continues apace. So there's a hidden item somewhere. Light soul stone, thank you. Candy. 65% chance. Oh, come on, come on, bro. Oh, I see the hidden item. Come on. Yes! Go. Ooh, medium fire soul stone. Let's go. See you in the dueling pit next time Toro goes live. <laughs> Gladly. Uh, great, uh, good. <laughs> uh, great, uh, good. Party Nan, thanks for the seven years, seven months. Wouldn't that be wild if it was seven years, seven months, seven, seven days, seven hours? Ooh, you suck. Who's booing me? Day, God damn it, Hellcat. Hello, hello, Katharina. Good Sunday morning. Cheers. How you doing? Thanks for the 23 month resub last stream. It'll never not be wild to me that we met when you were streaming Unity of all things. Dude, for reals, bro. Poison that must be purged. It's my turn now. And that was my introduction to Assassin's Creed, like the franchise. But you know what? Like when I when I do think about it, it's I think it was a great like a great business move in a sense because because it was so buggy, I feel like a lot of people just decided not to play it. So I didn't have much competition and I streamed late nights, so I was streaming when all the top streamers were offline and it had multiplayer, so I was able to do like play with people who like joined in the stream, you know. Yeah, that shit was buggy as fuck. <laughs> it, it was still a lot of fun though, for sure. Would not take it back for anything. Especially because that's where we met, dude. Also, uh, 
don't know if you remember fucking FH Competitive, one of my first mods. Met him, huh? met him through well, Unity as well. Yes, recently woke up, just got my coffee. Hells yeah, Katharina, that's what I like to hear. Um, you... How's that coffee machine treating you, by the way? It's like a new one, right? I mean, you've had it for a little bit. I remember we've talked about this, and I remember looking pictures of it on stream. gonna turn you into food. Now Thanks. Let's grab some food. I booed you for not having a Rick James back. Ah, oh, Hellcat, all I, I said I'll look at it after stream. <laughs> it's funny how your introduction to the franchise was the game that got me to give up on the series. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Started with AC Unity, so couldn't be disappointed afterwards playing any of the others. Lol. Mm hmm. It wasn't like the worst thing ever. I still feel like the world building in Unity is pretty, pretty good, and I, I know it's in a way better spot now. It's not like the buggy piece of shit that it was at launch. Yeah, I enjoyed the world of Unity for sure. Hope you're having a lovely week in Katharina. I love this coffee machine. Nothing has changed. Nice. Do you rarely actually go out and buy coffee now that you have that machine? I know that's the case for me. Sometimes I will, like very rarely. But yeah, I always just try to just drink all my coffee at home. And I mean... I. I make cold brew coffee, so that's like, it's fucking easy. So, uh, yeah, definitely saving on not buying Starbucks and shit all the time. Because for what it's worth, yo, dude, Starbucks is pretty, is like, it's pretty average at best. But yeah, I, it's, it's definitely convenient because it's on every corner. Take a look at our map. So. Now, our final character that we haven't recruited is Hikari, who is on the western continent, so... What we can do is fast travel to Canobrine and then make our way west over there. Okay, I'm done. I know you could die, WG. So much Bobby at once. <laughs> and like uh, a few games prior, if you had asked me, I'd have told you AC is my favorite game series. <laughs> this music is lit, dude. Already, man. Music in these games are really good. Some really good stuff, dude. 100%. Free items, appreciate it. <laughs> and yeah, no matter where you are in the game, Ardinan, if you switch the time, it switches between the day and night version. So, so essentially the soundtrack is doubled. I think the physical, the, um, the physical copy that I'm getting in a few weeks, hopefully. I think it's six discs. <laughs> uh, it's a total of like 132 tracks. If you want it, yo, dude. Like, if you want a digital version, Artie Nan, you're in my Discord, I'm pretty sure. 
go to the Octopath Traveler channel and click the pinned message, and you'll see you'll see a link for it right there. Yeah, music in this game is great, man. Who's booing me? All right, Tuki. Still playing Madden? But James or Riot? Like every morning, I am like, coffee, <laughs> coffee, coffee is love, is coffee is life, Katharina. It's gone, gone. Where in the world did I drop it? Wait, what's this quest? The last time I remember seeing it was in town in the Brightlands. After that, I boarded a ship heading this way via Totohaha. But now I don't have it anymore. How could I be so careless? Thank you. Thank you. Hey. Give me that shit. Wait, it's for PC? Uh, yeah. This game is, uh, yo, already in. I'm doing a giveaway for this game, by the way. So now that you're a sub, um, you can buy raffle tickets using your channel points. Bottom left corner of chat. And, um, it like, costs 500 each, and you can buy two per stream. Starbucks has lame coffee. Yeah, I think it's okay at best. But I don't know like coffee because I can get free Starbucks at work sometimes. I've got the coffee plug. Oh, nice. Pretty legit. Nah, 3%. Nah. Nah, I'm not getting that. To be honest, I think for people here, there is no such big culture to take coffee somewhere. Like, for example, every morning. Like, people do that, but I think most of the people are drinking coffee at home. Of course, when I am somewhere out or driving somewhere, I get coffee on my way or something, but uh, otherwise, I think it's not such a not such huge culture as in... Oh, I see, Katharina. I see, I see. I like the drinks that don't really have much coffee to them. The most... And I'm like... And I'm like, no point. Wait, what do you mean, Smokey? Can you give me, can you give me some examples? And we don't have Starbucks, for example. Ah, oh, that's okay. You're not missing out on much. It's just they're everywhere here, so it's very convenient. That's about it. Thanks, Ardenan. I enjoy tea as well, but I definitely prefer coffee. For sure. I love tea, tea and coffee. I love you. Oh, wow, right. Wow. Ew, PDA. Two. Why, lol? Chill, my man. Chill. Daddy, chill. Daddy, chill. Chill with me. Oh, I thought I already got information on any, everybody here. And also, and also here people are not getting two pumps vanilla syrup, two shots espresso cream, three pumps pistachio, one pump caramel. I have never heard someone doing something like that. For us, it's like Americano, espresso, latte, white coffee, etc. No one is getting some weird ass combos. Yeah, dude, that's Murica for you. Katharina literally had people that when I worked at Starbucks, they would ask for 15 pumps of sweetener. 15! A sailor on a liner to the eastern continent, he is a good-natured man with a bit of a short temper. He is close to his younger brother, Senna, and hopes to one day sail on the same ship as him. Cool story. Thanks for your axe. And thanks for your, your healing great bunches. Thanks. Muchos, muchos gracias. My husband and my son are such picky eaters. Cooking for them is always an ordeal. Fuck them. That's what I say. Fuck them. 
Townsperson, age 31, a local woman who lives with her husband and their son. Before marriage, she was a florist, and even now she does piecework, creating bouquets for people to offer at the church. She is also having an affair with an older man she met there. Awkward! Now I definitely don't feel bad taking your shit. <laughs> Locked. Bullshit. Let me in. Let me in. Yes, Ali, get your ticket. Get your ticket. I make my own coffee. Yeah, same. Want me to welt his rump for you, Smokey? One ounce coffee, 12 pounds sugar, one gallon of cream. I've had Starbucks, but I did not really like it. Coffee itself wasn't tasty. I've had a couple of times across different airports. I would maybe dig their sweet drinks if I am keen to get something sweet, but as for regular coffee, I did not like it. Yeah, I feel like the coffee that you make at your house is way better. I'm here with my family from New Delsta. What do you recommend as gifts for the folks back home? Hmm, let me see what you got. I recommend you give me that. 15%. Ooh, it's gonna be a bit of a tough one. Our part, you may be fucking lol, but no, man, you're good. So, thank you for your support. People leave. <laughs> Get back here, Brian. 15? Just drink hot chocolate with milk. Yeah, I already know. 15 pumps of sweetener. I'm like, you sure you want to just buy the bottle? It might actually save you money in the long run. Buy the bottle, and that'll serve you for, like, Four drinks? <laughs> We're the people that ask for extra, 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 extra caramel. I'm like, you know I'm like you know I'm running out of space on this cup. X, 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 X. <laughs> like, okay, I'll just unscrew the bottle and just pour it in there for you. <laughs> If they were nice, though, I never gave them shit. But yeah, the people that were assholes and they wanted shit like that. Oh, man, dude. I made sure to, I made sure to announce their drink in the most sarcastic way. I've got a Trenta green tea with 18 pumps of classic. Eight pumps of raspberry. And a free hospital visit to Kaiser. Ready at the bar. Walk up to me and she'd be like, fucking asshole. You started it. Perhaps basically I meant lol. Sorry, I barely get them, so I forget the name. They get uh, got small amounts. Okay, yeah, yeah. If it's too much PDA with coffee, sounds like situation when someone said after it burns when they pee would have a uh, different reasoning. What the fuck? Fifteen pump sweetener. Ouch. That's like why drink coffee then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your life, you do, I mean, live it how you want, but yeah. Got quite a bit of those customers. Tugs, I care about you, but I got to bubble. You've been poking it a bit too much, though. You was a good buddy. I think most extreme for people here is like caramel latte, please, and that's basically it. Probably some people are choosing other syrups as well, but usually it, it's, uh, it is one syrup taste plus the drink. You guys have restraint. Um, I start to believe people going to Starbucks isn't about the taste, but more uh, a status thing. That too, for sure. Because I literally had people coming in with their own thermometers, measuring the coffee to make sure that it was at the right temperature. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Like, oh. You're having one of those days, huh? <laughs> Okay. Uh, the wife of a trader from New Delsta traveling with him uh, and their daughter on a business trip to the Western continent. Her husband so neglected his home life for work that the two came perilously near divorce. But she was satisfied by the solution they arrived at. Traveling together as a family so they can spend more time together. Man, I want to I I I try this ice amulet, but... 
All right, fuck it. Let's gamble, chat. Let's do it. <laughs> Ultra combo! First shot. Let's go. Let's go. Sometimes I see some videos, people ordering stuff in US, and it blows my mind. <laughs> I, I bet, Katharina. I fucking bet. <laughs> blows my mind too, and I've been living here ever since birth. You're, you're, you're more, 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 more beautiful. Oh, it's okay. You got it. You got it. I believe you. Thanks for the bouquet and the healing grape. I'll take that. You got this, kid. Oh, were you, were you gonna give her those flowers? Not anymore. Are you from Canelbright? This town is simply beautiful. Yeah, yeah. He, that, that, that boy next to you. He wasn't gonna give you uh, any flowers. Hey, look over there. A, a bird. Thank you. I'll take that. Shut up, chat. Shh. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, you suck. Just shut, shut up, Ryan. Shut up, dude. I didn't notice. Wait, I'm sorry. Did I hear that right? 15 pumps? You did, par par. And I felt like a diva when I asked for two more pumps on a hot cocoa. Oh, no, 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 Parfar. You're good, dude. You're so good. I saw some videos of people trying Pedro Pascal Starbucks order, and it was actually funny because dude is drinking cold brew with six shots of espresso. And they try it, and their face goes like, ah! Yeah, my go-to drink before my shifts, Katharina, when I was working at Starbucks, was uh, uh, four shots of espresso with a splash of half and half. Called it a Breve Blaster. You guys just troll so much, it's hard for me to understand which is a joke or not, but yeah, he probably is. Lameo. Swear to God. I'm not actually. <laughs> and no matter how tragic the backstory is, Sam will always steal from them. <laughs> Welcome, like what you see, everything's a bargain, everything's delicious. That's cool. I usually prefer the freeway. Thanks. I prefer that five finger discount. Appreciate it. Slim chance to reduce target speed. High chance to take that shit without you noticing. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There's a young fellow on the tavern's entrance, you see. Spends all day there, waiting for somebody. He leaves when the sun sets, but then he comes right back and waits some more. More? Please, sir, can I have some more? Herb of Clarity, healing great. Thank you. Oh, thank you. My grandpa loves churches. Also, cathedrals. You know what I love? Loot. Thanks. I'll take that. Shh, shh, quiet. Shut up. This makes no sense. I've been waiting all day. I know this is the right place, but I'm getting tired of waiting here. It's all good. I'll uh, take this item over to her for you. I got you, I got you. Looking out for you, buddy. Ha! Got him! Got him indeed. Got him, chat. So what is this game about? So this game is about eight travelers who you meet. Um, you can choose any of them at the start, and they each have their own motives and stories. And um, yeah. Pretty shitty ass explanation. <laughs> I believe there is like an overarching main story that ties all those together, which I don't know yet. But yeah, it's essentially about eight eight travelers and they all have their own different stories. 
Mouse, go to sleep. Sugar, you go to sleep. No, you're good. Pets, kitty head. I said first. How it go with the marine thingy for your dad? Marine thing. Well, he ordered it, so hoping everything goes smooth. What what marine thingy? And I said it second. Prefer cats or dogs? It's such a random ass question. But yeah, um, our current party, Ochet, the one, the one that's in the front. Uh, her main quest is to find three creatures of legend to help protect her, uh, her little island right here. Where is she from? She's from right here. There is, uh, there's an event called the Great Calamity. And so yeah, she's on a she's on a a mission to find some pretty much think of like the three legendary birds from Pokemon to help out her uh, her town. Casty is an apothecary, and she her story starts with uh, her having amnesia, and so she's trying to figure out like her her backstory, like how she got to um, where she where she is at the start of the game. Throne, who's the thief in purple, her family, uh, well, not like genetic, but like the people that raised her. Um, she's in like a kind of like a thieves guild, and so she's trying to um, essentially get uh, get revenge on them, like her quote unquote mom and dad. Like she's trying to get out of the guild, and so yeah, she she's trying to take out the leaders. Agnia, the one in that orange dress. Um, she's she's on she's on a quest to become a uh, a famous dancer like her mom, and there's uh there's four other people but yeah that is the max party size. I never played Pokemon. I've been lurking. I appreciate it, Nicole. Thanks for lurking. Oh uh, but yeah, Artie Nan. They have a demo on Steam if you want to check it out. So yeah, I'm not doing any quote-unquote main quests right now. I'm just exploring around and uh, just stealing stuff. <laughs> I'm a Ludor. Former U Carpenter, age 53. An old man from U, a nation that met its end decades ago. As a carpenter, he was heir to the considerable technical wisdom U once boasted. He was even involved in the construction of Fort Orochi. Parts of which are still used for shelter by the poorest residents of Sai. Fort Orochi plans. Ooh. Need that for a side quest. Lul. I'm gonna check it out, definitely. Yeah, RD9, if you if you like classic style JRPGs and pixel art, I highly recommend it, dude. And that demo will definitely you, you'll know if it's something that you wanna uh, play further. Uh, you can play up to three hours, um, but even once you hit that three hour mark, you can just create a new save file and try out all eight travelers if you want to. No need to play the first one either. It is a it is a sequel, but yeah, it's all new characters, so no need to worry about that. If that's uh, if that was a point of concern. Trader age thirty seven, a new Delta trader, proactive and involved in many lines of business. He came to the Western continent to seek new wares. He travels with his family, believing that they should see the world as well. New equipment for sale. Nice. Heavy coin pouch. Silver rimmed monocle, 15 and 8%. Oh man, these are gonna be tough. These are gonna be tough. Fuck it, let's try. Shit. <laughs> Damn. Oh damn, alright, well there goes our reputation. <laughs> Shit. 
you know, each character has a unique thing that they can do, both at night, daytime and nighttime, whether it's recruiting people to help you along your adventures, or uh, the thief, she can steal things from, uh, from townsfolk. They all each have like a unique little, little action. Yeah, 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 I'll be on my best behavior. Maybe. Maybe. I wish more people knew how delicious the seafood is in this town. I wish to know what you're carrying. Thank you. Ooh, large ice soul stone. We need this for the side quest. I'm gonna try one round. If it doesn't, then we'll move on. Damn it, dude. Alright, shit. I gotta pay the rep fee again. <laughs> shit. Okay, hold on. Let me catch up with chat. 